I found him tramping in the woods. She was signing the paper. He was a good and reliable messenger. The landing was rough. I am very intimate with her. He would not let go of his dignity. I have dealt with people like that before. He jumped over a root. I juggled for your entertainment. I tried them on the dressing room. You are a blessing to me. There are billions of stars in the sky. The lightning is fascinating. There is a leak in the boat. I am fond of the dog. Ok, queria parar aqui rapidinho para te dar uma dica. I'm fond of the dog. Essa é uma, uma frase muito legal. Prova provavelmente a palavra fond é uma palavra nova para você. É muito importante você aprender as frases e criar muito vocabulário, muitas conexões aqui na sua cabeça. Mas não adianta nada você aprender a entender e não conseguir falar nada. Então eu queria te mostrar essa nova ferramenta que eu achei na internet. Você pode vir aqui, chama Teacher AI. Você pode vir aqui, em vez de escrever, você pode escrever também. Mas você pode falar aqui, por exemplo, eu não entendo direito essa palavra fond em inglês. Você pode me explicar? Fond significa ter carinho por algo ou alguém, gostar muito de algo. Por exemplo, em português, se você diz, sou muito apegado ao meu cachorro, em inglês poderia dizer, I'm very fond of my dog. Você tem algo que é muito apegado ou gosta muito. Aqui ele se respondeu para mim em português, mas se eu quero conversar com ele em inglês, eu posso fazer isso também. Você pode ir em português, inglês, português, inglês, não tem problema. Ele vai te entender. Por exemplo, eu vou perguntar para ele se você é fond, se você gosta muito de algum animal. Are you fond of any animals? Yeah, I love dogs. I think they're great companions. And you, do you have any pets? Por exemplo, daí você chegou aqui, ele está perguntando se eu tenho algum animal de estimação. Então eu posso continuar essa conversa e conversar, falar sobre tudo que eu quiser. Posso ficar aqui horas conversando em inglês com esse Teacher AI, que é um clone que eles fizeram. De mim. Aqui também é legal saber, por exemplo, você fala assim, ó, oh, companions, eu não sei essa palavra companions, você pode perguntar para ele, ele vai te falar também. Vou deixar aqui o link se você se interessou, se você achou legal. Isso aqui é revolucionário, eu acho que vai mudar a cena do inglês no mundo. Se você quiser começar a usar ele hoje, clica aqui no link aqui embaixo. He is quirky and hilarious. Do you have an alternative to my plan? She cannot be seduced. This is more modern. I do not like going into liquor stores. I love the month of June. Her toy is a stuffed animal. 
He is emotionally insecure. I am learning division and multiplication. If conditions are good, the plant will thrive. He had an arm transplant. She gives me tips on the quiz. Is she sufficient for the job? What she says is very surprising. We are surrounded on all sides. He quickly finishes the survey. Water is vital for your survival. His actions assure my suspicion. I swap seats with her. He shows no sympathy for her. She has a tendency to bite her nails. The tent collapsed. Their room is very tidy. The ring is made from tin. The box weighs about a ton. Pink hair is the new trend. His job is tricky, but he likes it. He writes a tune on the piano. The train goes through a long tunnel. The tire on the car pops. Their ultimate aim was to force his resignation. Understanding her words is hard. He is single and unemployed. That is unfortunate what happened to him. She has a very unique dress. It is unknown who wrote the book. She practices uppercase letters.
He lives in an urban town. She gets a sudden urge of danger. The secretary says it's urgent. He bought a used car. The gem is very valuable. There were various solutions. The vehicle was brand new. The task was virtually impossible. Patience is a virtue. Visibility was very bad. He was a visitor in this town. The tape was vital for the mission. The ride was completely voluntary. He had to withdraw from the party. The news was widespread among the people. His success was widely known. She whispered into his ear. She is a bright little youngster. He got punched in the gut. There were crocodiles at the zoo. She writes in a different dialect. He borrows an e-book from his friend. She was young and hardy. The disease is incurable. The dance jockey is good at his job. I like to eat junk food. She has a mania for cats. The bread has margarine on it. She follows him to the mosque. They are learning about prepositions and nouns. He has to proclaim the news.
She gives shivers. They are skillful with their swords. The bone wasn't in its socket. He is a good sportsman. It's around here somewhere. He has a sweetheart back home. It is amazing what she can do. He definitely closed the window. The detective has no evidence. She quietly goes upstairs. The journey is very dangerous. He is completely innocent. The apartment is apparently empty. Congratulations for your success. He had a lot of experience. She chose a medical career. That's incredible.